In my first video in this tutorial on making a music player with Bash, I showed you how to use XMMS2, and that's what we're going to use today to uh, basically we're making a GUI interface for that. Uh, I showed you that if you use XMMS2 toggle play, you can toggle play and pause with the same command. Uh, you can also use XMMS2 next to go to the next song and prev to go to the previous song. So now we just need to tell our user interface that that's what we want to do. So we're going to program these three buttons in here today. Um, basically you select a button, I'm going to select this next button, and we come under signals and then click. So this is what's going to happen when you click on this button. I'm going to double click where it says type here, and you're just going to type in the command you already know, XMMS2, and that's our next button, so we type in next. Now this is the important part. Uh, you have to hit enter here. If you click out of the box or on something else, it doesn't save that, so you have to hit enter there. That's something I forget quite often. I already did the play button with XMMS2 toggle play, and we'll do the previous button here with XMMS2 and PRV, a PREV for previous enter. Now, oops, now all we have to do is click save and run our command that we already know, our GTK dialog, uh, our Glade XML file, which is I've named my XMMS, uh, my XMMS .glade, and the window we want to open, program equals window one. And our little player opens up, and our buttons work. Now with XMMS2, uh, we also can set volume. So if we do XMMS2 volume, we can do 50 for 50%. 50 so, oh, that's not what I want to do. Let's do play. So our volume is at 50%. We can put it down to 25% or 10% or all the way up to 100%. So now, we just need to tell our GUI that that's what we want to do. So, we're going to click on our 100% here, go to Signals, clicked, XMMS2, Volume 100, hit Enter, and do that for each of these buttons, obviously changing the uh, percentage to the percentage that, that represents that button. So in this case, we're going to say volume 90. And do that for each of these buttons. And we've already got our music player that plays, pauses, goes to next song, previous song, and controls volume. Uh, and we'll go into more once uh, I do my next tutorial. Hope you're enjoying this. Visit bashscripts.info for more Bash Script lessons, videos, and tutorials.